Namaste, Ayurveda friends. I'm Dr. Anisha Gervais, and I'm happy to share with you a simple Marma protocol working with five of the scalp energy points today. First, I'll show you how to locate them and then a simple protocol of how to stimulate all of them. We're gonna start with our Kapala Marma, which is right here on the forehead, right at the midline of the hairline. So you're finding that Kapala Marma right here. The next point is Mridni or Adipati Marma at the crown. The easiest way to locate this is to come to the tips of the ears and place your palm there. Let the middle fingers reach to the crown and that meeting point where the middle fingers touch is Mridni or Adipati Marma. From here we're going to measure two Anguli. Oh, an Anguli is the width of the middle finger. So we're measuring two Anguli in front of Mridni to get our Brahma Randra Marma. And then we're going to measure two Anguli behind Mridni to get Shiva Randra Marma right here. So all three of these points are in a row. Brahma Randra, Mridni, and Shiva Randra all along the midline of the scalp. So we have Kapala first, these three Marma points at the top of the head, and then we're going to come to the very back where the occiput is, and right below that bony protuberance is a depression where we find Manyamula Marma. So we can stimulate all five of these points together with a very simple protocol. We'll start with using all four fingers like this that are going to be pushing gently into the scalp along that midline. Starting at Kapala Marma, take a nice deep breath and then we're going to just go back one finger breath at a time. With each of those movements you can take a deep breath here, you can take several breaths, whatever you like and whatever feels comfortable. As you keep going you'll be stimulating Brahma Randra. Next as you come to the crown you'll be stimulating Mridni Marma. As you go behind Mridni you'll stimulate Shiva Randra Marma. And then you're going to just keep going along the back of the scalp. You can do a hold at each of these marma points, the three on the scalp, for at least three breaths. I'm just going a little quicker for the video. And then I'm going to keep coming back to the bony protuberance here is the occiput. And I'm going in the depression right below it to get the Manyamula Marma. So once you're here at Manyamula Marma, I'm pressing with both middle fingers like this and doing a little deeper pressure because it is a depression. Once you're here at the depression, go ahead and close the eyes and take three deep breaths. As you repeat this protocol, I would recommend doing it at least three times, starting with the Kapala Marma, working your way to the Manyamula Marma. With each of these, as I said, you can go one breath at a time. The three scalp marma points you can hold for at least three breaths, if not longer. And then when you come to Manyamula at the occiput, I would recommend holding it for at least one to two minutes. These points are going to help with balancing the emotions, vata, pitta, or kapha emotions, calming the mind, reducing stress, balancing your hormones, also helping to improve your sleep. And if you have headaches, this is an excellent protocol to do daily to help restore pranic balance and prevent those headaches. I hope that you use this simple self-care marma technique as part of your daily protocol to feel calm, to feel relaxed, to feel alert. Thank you so much, and I hope that you enjoyed this simple marma protocol.